<laughs> All right. It still wants to climb. Man, just need some. Maybe I'm hitting the wrong. I'm hitting the wrong thing. That's why. <laughs> I was hitting the throttle. Okay. Now, I don't know what's going on with this trim. Maximum trim reached. That's maximum trim right there. So it looks like I still need to bring it a little bit. Now that's pretty good right there. It still wants to climb. I, th I may just need to bring that elevator down more. It's still a little bit above the center position because I thought it needed a little bit of it because it was a, quite a bit above the center position before. So I brought it to where it was just slightly above the center. It looks like I need to head more towards center. I'll have to see where it's at once I bring it down and it's in neutral position. I'll have to see where it's at. Probably shouldn't run full blast the whole flight or I'm gonna run out of juice. <laughs> well, yeah, it's a lot more controllable now coming across it doesn't hurt that the wind has died down a little bit it should roll better too now that it doesn't have that automatic up Let's see oh yeah <laughs> nice tight rolls got one motor that doesn't sound quite right sound like one motor might have slipped the prop or something I don't know it did sound a little weird didn't it Hear that? It's almost like one of the props might be slipping a little. Yeah, that's weird. Yeah, you know, and I had the, I actually let the ma magic smoke out of these ESCs once when I ran it too much full throttle. You know, I ran it full blast for a really long time and the ESCs got hot and, but I had a different brand of ESC in there and I changed to the flight test brand because they're pretty durable. Yeah. But that doesn't mean I didn't damage one. We'll see. Might just be a prop slipping. Cause it sounds like one's slightly different pitch than the other. Maybe a prop nut's coming loose. <laughs> Maybe I should land it. <laughs> Maybe I'm flying on one prop. <laughs> you mean one motor? <laughs> one motor, yeah. I can still hear the twin. It's just that one kind of goes, eh, I don't think so. You want to fly it? No. <laughs> oh, come on. I'm rusty, man. Yeah. Look how it's nice now that I, now that I changed the elevator, it's nice. I can control it straight on better, you know what I mean? Like I can come low and slow and got better control over it. Do you have differential? I do not. I never oh, programmed it into like it. That. You can program differential into it. I have to run an extra wire. I've got a, I've got a joint, you know, a Y cable on it right now. Yeah, that one prop sounds a little funky. Well, maybe that's why I looked like it was. You had differential. Maybe. Coming at me. Maybe one prop is pushing more than the other. Yeah. You might want to land it. <laughs> I don't a lot want of talk. to though. Doing a lot of talk. I don't want to. <laughs> You're right. I should check out why my motor sounds why funny. It's, why it's it's like, I don't think so. Yeah. <laughs> but it's so much fun. I want to fly it. It's up to you. Okay, typically, if a pilot was in there and he heard his plane doing like that, yeah. he'd like land the sucker. Yeah, he'd be like, I need to land somewhere. <laughs> Not me, man. <laughs> fly it till it's done. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> it's when I go full throttle. It's when I go full throttle. It's like, one of the motors is like, I can't go full throttle. Might be a ESC issue. I should just put some monster ESCs on there. No. I'm just doing some slow passes just to get some good footage. Oh, my battery's done. <laughs> I'm done for. I gotta land. I'm gonna try to land closer to me if I possible. Yeah, into the grass, man. That was a little hard. 